Oh my, what a beautiful day. Good day, Miss Penelope. So nice to see you out and about. And a good day to you, sure dog, Hobson. Hey, Mama. I believe the crisp morning air has given me an epiphany. Gazuntai. Jot this down, won't you? During any criminal investigation, however minor the infraction, one must utilize the entire range of sensory perception or risk overlooking some invaluable clue. Did you get that, Hobson? Yeah, you gotta use all five senses. <laughs> Dear Hobson, I can always count on your simple mind to reduce my most profound thoughts down to the least educated level. Perhaps today we will be so fortunate as to encounter an opportunity to demonstrate this principle. A murder, perhaps. Yeah, for all those murderers stupid enough to do it in the park in broad daylight. You mock me, Hobson, but I myself have considered a murder in the park in broad daylight. Extremely recently, in fact. Good day, Mr. Whisper. Yes, it is. Good day, Mr. Little. Oh, it's an absolutely delicious day. Call me if you get the scoop on anything criminal, sure dog. But of course. Oh, dear Lord. Don't look down, Hobson. Holmes, you're right. Something's afoot. That unscooped poop is an improper disposal violation. Why don't you get down there and use your five senses on that infraction? Hobson. Oh, I understand. Even you couldn't solve that one. Very well, Hobson. Let your lesson begin. Notice the slightly distorted appearance of the air around it, which indicates that the fecal matter is emitting a small stream of water vapor. It looks like a fresh steaming turd. Got it. <coughs> It also seems to be emitting a pungent and powerfully malodorous stench. It stinks like a turd. Check. I do believe I have everything I need to solve this crime, Hobson. Huh? uh You've got three more senses. Get down there real close and tell me what that turd sounds like. <clears throat> it sounds faintly bubbly. Poppin' turd bubbles. Uh-huh. That's only three. If you insist on mocking me, at least help me with this glove. Now, let me see. Ooh, it's moist and soft and, dare I say, a bit warm to the touch. Hmm, feels like a turd. Check. I believe this glove may have a hole in it. Oops. Well, I think there's just one more sense left. I don't think there's any need for that. Oh, I see. You were flat out wrong when you said all five senses. No worries. You can't be right all the time. Oh, there he goes. He's doing it. <coughs> Tastes like a churn. Check. Hmm. Sure dog. Yes. Anything criminal. Sure dog. Yes. Anything criminal. Hobson, I believe I have it. Well, go on, lay it out for me. Judging from the moisture content, the steam, the still powerful smell, the stink, the soft texture, the squish, and the barely detectable sounds of bubbles popping on its surface, the pop, as well as other evidence the flavor i deduce that this mound of feces was deposited no longer than five minutes ago which leaves us with only three suspects miss penelope mr little and mr whisper <laughs> those devils from the size of the droppings i believe we can eliminate mr whisper as the color is brown and not grayish white, Mr. Little can also be eliminated. This leaves only Miss Penelope. A careful examination of her posterior will no doubt reveal further incriminating evidence. See there, Doubting Hobson. Despite your ridicule, my sleuthing principles have proven indeed superior. Oh yeah, you definitely showed me. You're a crack investigator. 
You found the smoking gun. Oh, Hobson, you showed me what brown does for you.